Exporting an interactive PDF. In the previous video we created some basic form fields. As you can see here we've got a text field and we've got some checkbox fields available. And now let's go ahead and export them out. So exporting an interactive PDF is the simplest file and export. Control E. Yours may default to this, to Adobe Print. If you do Adobe Print, the form will export out, but the fields will not be clickable. You will not be able to actually print them out. I'm sorry, fill them out digitally. So go ahead and make sure you select Adobe PDF Interactive, and then you just click Save. You're going to get a pop-up here. What you want to do is make sure that um, all of these settings are, are set up right here, but I would encourage you to create a tagged PDF. In uh, more advanced videos, you're going to actually learn to create tab orders so you can basically control how you tab through the field. For example, it's first name and last name were two separate fields and they were side by side. You'd want to say, hey, I want you to tab to skip the, through the fields uh, using a particular order. So make sure you create the tab PDF and then in that case we would talk about structured tab order. But for right now, that's enough. We just click export. And mine's going to open up here in uh, Adobe uh, Acrobat. Yours might open up in Adobe Reader. And I'm going to fit it to uh, the height so we can see the entire form here. And basically, you can see I can click in here and say, Harry, the teacher. And the ship's name was InDesign 101. The checkboxes. Again, you can select checked or unchecked for dead and alive or both. It's not conditional, so one or the other. Now, I'm going to go ahead and click tab, and you can see I've got the pirate name selected. Tab again, InDesign, dead, and alive. So you can use the tab key to navigate through, and that's going to be important for ADA compliance. So you do want to make sure that it is navigatable uh, using the keyboard. Okay, that's the very first one in exporting an interactive PDF. There'll be more advanced videos coming up.